Uh, so we're doing this wonderful program together, which is um, our two works, Scarlatti's um, uh, Erminia and Geminiani's Enchanted Forest. And uh, why don't I tell our audience about the plot of Erminia, and you can tell them about the plot of the Enchanted Forest. Sure. And the, um, the Erminia, um, the both stories come from this uh, Renaissance, Italian Renaissance poet, Tasso, and his, his uh, stories about Jerusalem delivered. Um, and so uh, Erminia is really about, is a romance uh, between um, a, a Muslim princess and a, and a Christian um, warrior and uh, the tension of, of their, their love, but the fact that they're on different sides of this conflict. Um, and there's an element of that in the in Gemini, the although it's not really what the Enchanted Forest is about, right? Right, right. Enchanted Forest is... Again, more about there is a there is a love story embedded in the yeah. story, but um, it's really about the Crusaders um, trying to take Jerusalem, and they need to get past this forest, which uh, which then they're unable to because there's a spell that's been cast on this forest by one of the one of the people from Jerusalem, and and um, and, the, and 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 the whole uh, ballet ends with. The crusaders being able to get past the spell by right, by right. killing killing this this person this this person that Rinaldo the character Rinaldo is in love with, uh, which is kind of a tragedy uh, embedded within the love story. But then she comes back alive in the form of the forest, which I think is very charming. It's a very it's a magical tale to me. It's a it's it's a, almost like a fairy tale, even though. It's set against the backdrop of the war between the Crusaders and the, yeah. and the people in Jerusalem. Yeah, yeah.